Can I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. And get in that car Leave a little note and we'll drive real far Let's get out, we can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing All righty, we are here at the famous Swimming Pigs It is a crowded anchorage too that, There's at least I don't know, 80 plus boats in here. So we're gonna probably struggle to find an anchorage close by, but we'll, uh, we'll see what we can do. Caught behind the Venetian blinds, how to reach for the city lines. And this ain't where I belong. Ain't looking me, mono, what I become. I've been running east, looking for something, digging deep since '99. I'm excited. You excited? Yes. Are you gonna swim with these? Yes. Yeah, she has swim with the sharks, so we'll see if she swims with pigs. I swim with them. Uh huh. I like mammals. You like mammals? It's, uh, it's definitely a crowded anchorage though, so the plan is to drop anchor, go see the pigs, and then move on to Staniel Key. Because everything I've read says uh, between the other boats and all the tour boats coming in, it's just a constant uh, state of uh, being in a boat weight. So you got winds coming out of the uh, southeast right now from over there. So it might be better to tuck in kind of over here a little bit. You got this little piece of land sticking out right here. So if we can tuck in, you know, the beach is right there, obviously, so we can tuck in over in here. We're trying to find a good spot to anchor right now. We are about to go see the little piggies, except they're not little piggies. Um, I was hoping they were like little cute pot belly piggies, but we can see them from here and they're about the size of cows. <laughs> I'm not sure if they're going to be so squishy like I thought, but I'm still excited. Hi. You're pretty, you're pretty cute up close. Hi. 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 Well, he thinks I have food. I, I, he'd probably be more likely to bite us than the shark. Oh my goodness, that's I a big boy. Oh my goodness, look at this guy. Hi, buddy. I, I don't, don't have any food for you. I'm sorry. I want to see you. Oh, you come to Fran. No, <laughs> they're running. So, oh, you going to give us some foodie? You're a cute little potato when you're swimming. Oh, Hi. Hi. Oh, don't drink the water. Let me see. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if this one's angry about something. Are you mad about something? I think that one's a little angry about something. I'm not sure what that one. I think the other one got in his water. Oh, <laughs> piggy. Marcy's coming after you, Marcy. Marcy's coming after you. We left the uh, swimming pigs. What'd y'all think? Honest thoughts. Well, honestly, there's a lot of poop everywhere, and it has that stinky farm smell that you smell at the fair 
Um, I mean, they're sweet and they're well taken care of and that makes me happy. You can't feed them on the beach because they're fed and they will, they'll bite you. Like if you feed them, they're, they're more of a threat than the sharks to bite you. But, um, I mean, they were cute, the ones that were sleeping. But, yeah, one of them ate something that upset his stomach, quite obviously. So, uh, yeah, there's a lot of that around. <laughs> probably, probably he ate a fish or something. <laughs> Fishy, but. He had yummy the runs. when we eat it. <laughs> yummy yeah. when we. Yeah. Glad we went, but won't be back, probably. Right? What'd you think? Yeah. It's definitely a uh, one of those things do it and uh, okay you say you did it and now we're done uh there's poop everywhere and they're peeing in the water and pooping it's, it's it's pretty gross we didn't stay too long we uh we saw the pigs been there done that uh, I, don't, I don't think we have any desire to come back here yeah papa tom would not fare well there papa tom we don't need to add this on the list when y'all come to come to visit <laughs> he wouldn't even get out of the boat no, he <laughs> i'm pretty sure he all right, let's swing by. Let's go check out this little cave. Uh, and then we'll head on back to the boat. Baby, don't you understand That we only get one life I want to make it count, honey Come on now and take my hand Hey, darling I love it when it's me and you On the road with a couple of tunes in a car All right, so we need to provision and we need to provision badly. It has been about two, two and a half weeks since we last went to a grocery store, which would have been up in Nassau. We are completely out of produce, um, bread, all of the stuff we bought in Nassau with the short shelf life, it is gone. And we have been <laughs> scraping and scrimping <laughs> with what we have left. And I think we are, uh, we need some options. So. Uh, there are two grocery stores around the corner over at Staniel Keys. So we are going to hop in the dinghy, go around the corner, and see what they have available to us. So let's go. And this is the grocery store. Hey, Chickies. Pink oh, Pearl oh, Supermarket. Oh, We just left the grocery store. We went to, where did we go, Katie? We went to Pink Pearl and Burks. Pink Pearl and Burks, yes. Uh, two grocery stores on the island, and I use grocery store in quotation marks. It is nothing like back home. Selection's very, very limited. Uh, you got one or two options on most categories. If you're lucky, they even have it. Um, and it's about four times more expensive. We spent in total, I think, $130 on mainly just a few fruits and vegetables and eggs. Yeah, the general rule of uh, four times the prices of back home is still kind of holding true. Um, but yeah, the biggest thing is just uh, limited selection, uh, especially in produce. Yeah, but we've been out of uh, produce now for about, what, two weeks now, Katie? Yeah, one or two weeks. So, yeah, and they just didn't have a whole lot of it, but we were able to get uh, the basics, bananas, apples, oranges, and uh, some bread. But, uh, all right, but we're heading back to the dinghy now and then back to the boat. The bugs have been just brutal today. Uh, the lady yeah. at the grocery store said the last couple of days they've had a nice breeze, so they haven't been out, but they're out in full force today. So yeah. we're, uh, we're heading on back right now, get back to the boat and uh, maybe hop in the water. It's starting to get a little hot. I know, I know you were crying because you're 
I have a covered squirrel. Oh, well, thank you for sharing, Lincoln. Mmm, thank you. Oh, that's good. That's a good M&M. I know you like blue the best. Well, thank you so much. Not that much. Is that everything? That's everything. Oh my. For $130. $130. The both the kids got one candy bar. So you can add that to it. Wow. Okay. So what yeah. are your thoughts on this? Yeah, I mean everything uh is significantly more expensive in the Bahamas. Yeah. So it is what it is. So mama, when we got to pick out what we wanted, she chose sour cream and onion <laughs> and diet coke. Daddy got <laughs> two pairs, oh. two onions, or uh, not onions. <laughs> two pairs and two oranges. Well, aren't you just a so, um, yeah. perfect human? <laughs> I would have gotten beer too, but they didn't have any. Yeah. Shame on them. I would have been on board with that one. I was hoping for uh, some. How do you how do you pronounce it? Calic? Cal? I don't know. It's spelled K A L I K, I believe. That's the local beer here on the islands. We Good. haven't been able to find any. We asked someone when we were ordered one right when we got here at a bar. Um, Cole was like, so is it like Bud Light? <laughs> is that how I sound? <laughs> and they just laughed at us. So it's a little tastier than Bud Light. It is exactly the same as Bud Light. It was pretty similar. No, it's tastier, but it's just funny. They're like, oh God, this red note. Alrighty, lunch is served with our new groceries. We got a little bagel, sharp cheddar, tomato, avocado, and everything but the bagel seasoning. This is also why I never show pictures of what I eat because I am too impatient to wait once it's ready to take a picture. All right, Lincoln wants to do a little snorkeling since it's so hot, so I think we'll leave you guys right there. We hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Say bye, Lincoln. Bye.